It's great this DNA testing, isn't it? I mean, you're going to be able to find the mum dead easy. They can't make you take a test if you don't want it. Yeah, they can. It helps with the police inquiries. The police can force you to do anything. I think it'd be good if you made every single woman on this estate take a test. I'd volunteer. What about you? I don't know, they can find out loads about you with them tests, like if you've done drugs and that. You've been clean for ages though, haven't you? Yeah, sometimes it can stay in your blood for years. <laughs> yeah, right. Anyway, I wish you'd never even started this stupid dick. None of this would have happened if you hadn't. She must have felt like crap, eh? Mother, if you felt anything, sorry, she might have been a junkie, might she? Out of her face on booze and drugs, living room. Fuck! Lock me up. I'm gonna go to jail. I think I know who's the baby is. I don't think you do, Janice. It's Maxine's. It can't be. She would have told me, you know how close we are. She's my best mate and all, she never told me. She's admitted it. Maxine, Janice told me. It's true. It was my baby. Might as well just turn around and walk away. I'm not going to walk away. But I am going to ask you why you didn't tell me. Because I nearly accused another girl of being the mother. It was me, okay? I buried that baby. But why? Does it matter why? I was out of my mind on drugs. My murderer, good ass. I knew I was pregnant. I just kept hiding it from myself, hoping it would go away. I was living in the car. Just getting wasted all the time, trying to block it out. And then I felt the baby come in. Oh. I ran to the school hoping to get Stacy or Janice, but by the time I got there, the bell had gone and there was no one around. It was dark. Then it came out. Just lying there. Didn't breathe or cry or nothing. It was so small. I had eyebrows and little. I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what to do. <laughs> um, I think I got the wrong girl. Bridget, can you get Mr. Lawson up here, please? I wanted it to be mine so much. I never had anything of my own, you know, that I could take care of. Maxine, you've been very brave. And if you can cope with it, I want you to be even more brave. I think that the girls in this school need to know your story. You have absolutely nothing to be ashamed of, Maxine. Max, you don't want anyone else to go through what you did, do you? Hey, what's up? 
Oh. Just can't cope with this. Really? Why? <laughs> it's nothing, really. Why wait a minute? Why? Just reminds me how much I miss my son. Eddie. I've got a report to write, Rachel. Am I going to get into trouble, miss? Oh, what for? The police are here to help, Maxine. You can always talk to one of us. No one's going to accuse you of being a criminal when you're not. Come on. I'll see you later, Steph. <laughs>